with Leslie Cavendish. Leslie Cavendish is Paul McCartney's barber. I guess we're going to extremes to try and, and find out uh, for the American public if the real Paul McCartney's like. What do you think of these rumors? I think they're ridiculous. Paul McCartney is alive and well. I saw him two weeks ago, and I cut his hair. And it's the same Paul McCartney I've been cutting for three and a half years. I guess you could tell the difference in hair from one person to another. I would think so, because if he was another person, Paul McCartney has, um, a, a, when you comb his hair back, it naturally parts just off center. And if it was somebody else, it, would, it was impossible to get the parting. And the parting is still there, and it's the same hair, and it's the same Paul McCartney. <laughs> And you've been cutting his hair since prior to Sergeant Pepper, haven't you? I've been cutting it for, for three years now. And uh, I think it's ridiculous. <laughs> I don't know what to say. You don't see any uh, scars from plastic surgery behind the ears? There's no scars. There's nothing. You know, it's Paul McCartney. There's no scars. He hasn't any plastic surgery. His hair's the same. Everything's the same. I kind of, you know, I think it's a very funny story that's going out. You must see him regularly, about once every two, three weeks, yeah. uh, for I the last many one, years. I see him once a month for the last two and a half years, three years. I even went down the Magical Mystery Tour, which was two years ago, a year and a half ago, two years ago. WMC in New York. a week with him. You know, and he didn't, there was nobody else there. There was just four Beatles. <laughs> They find some hidden meaning in, in certain photographs that are contained in the American album of uh, Magical Mystery Tour, which I understand was two EPs over mm -hmm. here, but it was an album there, and they put a booklet in there and everything showing pictures. And uh, you say you were around when they were filming that picture. Did you see them trying to put in any special uh, cl uh, clues and cryptic messages to the public? Not at all. I think they were there just to work and sing songs and do a film. That's what, that's what everyone else was doing down there. And I didn't have time to do anything else. Stop in the street. Looks any different to me. And a slow burn. 